Hello and welcome to another video on the channel. We get a review or unboxing time. We get uh, these uh, palette knives to open and look at. This is something I got for my uh, work on concrete. Uh, some for detailing concrete, let's say like that. And these are probably used more for like painting and stuff like that. But uh, these are really awesome for working on uh, smoothing out or shaping concrete. Really, really solid thing to work on, work with uh, on concrete. So let's uh, let's open this up. I'll also leave a link in the description where you can get uh, these or similar uh, palette knives. But uh, let's go and open this up and look closely each one. All right, so we get five of these in a set, and this is the smallest one, the one that I use the most. And the reason why I use this most is exactly because it kind of works like a fine knife for detailing, especially in concrete. I might show you in some of the upcoming videos how I use these. Uh, palette knives but uh, this one it's it's probably why I bought this in the first place but um, let's look at the uh, number two so this is the one that I also use a lot especially because of the scooping and how I use this is not like this like a fork or spoon I use it like this so this part I use to you know put uh, concrete because it's very convenient that way and this this way it's like I just pour in. No, I take this. I'll show you maybe on some of the upcoming videos. But uh, this one I also like a lot, especially because of this edge. It's uh, different than the rest of them, because this edge uh, can really uh, be nice to to drive when I make a line. But uh, anyway, it's it's usable. All of these are very usable. This one, it's not as much as the number one, but. Um, Still, I use it. Okay, number three, as I like to call it all around, uh, the this blade or this section is not too big, too long uh, for most works, but um, it has that surface area, so I can take a, a lot more than with number one. So I usually use this one uh, for you know driving the line, and uh, it's uh, it's very. Uh, precise like for precise work not a lot i don't use it that much but especially if i have a longer line and i and want to make a, a straight edge i i use this one but uh, i don't use it that often to be honest i like to use it when i use it uh, it does work uh, pretty well but uh, it's not that frequent okay this one uh, number four of course has longer blade or longer uh, section here this one i'm not sure that i use that often but sometimes i use this for caulking <laughs> uh, to to clear the caulk uh, especially if i use that um, silicone from tubes and just uh, you know make caulk and then just clear the caulk from both sides uh, I, I use it that way i'm not, not sure how to explain but if this is a, an edge i just use it like down and from this side so yeah it's pretty good also good for you know pour, putting caulking <laughs> into the small gaps so you can fill in the holes and making the smoothness so it's pretty good for that i don't use it much for concrete uh, sometimes i use it to punch like uh to split uh, split uh, concrete maybe for mixing but um, i don't use it that often for concrete i don't know we'll see maybe i will use it maybe occasionally but not often this one probably use a little more uh the bigger one biggest one number five has a bigger surface area a uh, longer section and i use this one for you know nice and smoothing out finish you know, and concrete if you can imagine uh, i'm gonna show you how i use this one but uh, this is for you know fine work and or um flattening let's say like that to make it really nice 
and uh, works very well i like this one also this section i kind of use to you know kind of cut i don't know how to explain but when i get uh, uh, chips of uh, concrete i kind of like to cut with this it's uh, i don't know it's very rounded kind of very very circular round edge here and it's it's uh, it's working very nice for for that kind of stuff i might show you that but anyway uh, this is the unboxing i'll, I'll leave a link in description for one of these that you can find or similar they're a really awesome tool to have uh, you can use them maybe in the kitchen as well for cooking but they're very versatile things and very nice looking as well there you go leave a like in the video if you liked it and subscribe to the channel to see more videos like this bye